Hey y'all, Kelly Vaughn with the Vaughn team at Keller Williams, um, your real estate fairy godmother because I make your dreams come true. We have made it, yay! Um, we are now at video number seven in our seven costly seller mistakes series. So thank you to those of you who have hung in there with us. We appreciate it. Um, if you missed videos one through six, check us out on YouTube or on Facebook. So, all right, mistake number seven being present during showings. I understand that as a seller, you sometimes feel like no one knows your house as well as you do and no one can sell your house as well as you do. But what I will tell you is that allowing the real estate professionals who bring buyers to your home to sell your home will get you sold faster and for more money. It is often very uncomfortable when a seller is in a home during a showing or an open house. Buyers want to experience the home on their own. They don't want to feel like they need to couch their comments to their realtor. They don't want to feel like they're going to offend you as the seller um, if they don't like something that you've done to the home. They want to make sure that they can, you want them to be able to speak freely and openly to their realtor because that's the only way you're gonna get good quality feedback on your home and that you're gonna be able to make any adjustments that you need to in the way your home is presented or in the way your home is priced is if you get that honest feedback from buyer agents. Um, so make sure that you give buyers and the agents their space when they are showing a home. Take the dogs for a walk, go run errands, go walk around the block, go visit with your neighbor. Please let the professionals do their jobs because they know what is most important to their buyers and they're going to be able to highlight those things about your house that will appeal most to your to the buyers. The buyers um, obviously have a criteria list that they're looking at. They have certain things that they want in a home. And the buyer agent is going to be able to point those things out. What is important to the buyer may not be what you feel is most important to you about your home. But keep in mind, it's not going to be your home anymore. So make sure that the buyer agent is able to do his or her job in showcasing your home to that buyer so that's it that's the seven common costly seller mistakes thank you for hanging in there with us um, we'll be doing other series coming up um, we've got one coming up of common realtor pricing mistakes that you as a seller need to know We've got one coming up about the 10 questions you need to ask any real estate professional before you invite them into your home. So we've got some good information and content coming up for you guys. Thank you for hanging in there with us. Hope you have a fantastic day. Please be kind to each other. And don't forget, we're never too busy for your referrals. Have a great day. Bye.